All right, later, Marge. Later, Marge. Stop trying to enlist our children in the military. Like, enlist if you want to when you're of age, but like, not when you're of age. Stop trying to enlist our children, our in, children. The, in the military. Tell us more jokes, Rollo. Let's hear a riddle. What fish is famous? I have no idea. A starfish. <laughs> hey, I've got a lot more riddles where that came from. Can we please leave? Hey, you should buy jokes instead of getting them for free. <laughs> He's the clown equivalent of, um, Winrar. <laughs> yeah, basically. Do, 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 do. Do. It's Gil you Barker. You look like Gil Barker. That's because we're twins. <laughs> my name's Gillian. I'm Freddy, <laughs> and this is my friend Luther. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. Are they boy girl twins? Or is Yeah, it... they're boy girl twins. Oh, because they look so similar. I thought it was They literally just took Gil Barker's character model, put eyelashes and lipstick and a hairdo on it, and that's it. Yeah. Also <laughs> Don't you love how I just carry a photo of my twin brother around me everywhere I go? <laughs> oh I love how it's Gil and Gillian. <laughs> you must be proud of your brother Gil's success. I wish it was Gil and Jill. Family is proud. I like Gillian. We come from a long line of Barkers, you see. I've definitely heard that voice at somewhere. Come on down, everybody! Plankters for sale! One <laughs> purple sea urchin per bag! Jawfish love them! <laughs> so we can buy Plankton Oats for one purple sea urchin, or buy a pun for, oh, for three. For three. <laughs> One of those sounds better. You and Gil look so it's much definitely alike. the pun. You're a I've heard that all <laughs> my life. You even have the same briefcase. Oh, now you're making things up. <laughs> it's actually just Gil Barker. That's what drag. I thought it was. I thought it was Gil Barker and drag. I was like, well, that, I guess that's maybe he's the bad guy. That's progressive of uh, the entertainment. I don't. I don't want that in my children's games. <laughs> Me neither. Hi there. I'm Freddy, and this is Luther. We'd like to talk with the mayor, if possible. I'm Clyde. The mayor's all yours as soon as I'm done with his makeover. It's just that I'm missing my number 15 fin pick. Where could it be? It must be back in my barber shop. I'm so absent-minded these days. I'll go look for it. We'll go look for it, if you'd like. What dears? Quick as a bunny, just run over to my barber shop. The fin pick should be right there. I completely trust you with all of my keys. Hang these keys up on the hook inside the barber shop when you found the fin pick. What were the okay. keys doing in the mayor's pedicure? <laughs> is pedicure for your hands or is manicure for your hands? Manicure's for your hands, pedicure's for your feet. Okay. Why was that doing in the neighbor's manicure? Don't know. Water also, also why... how is that we're in water? Also, how why is... do you need yeah. to dip your Hands in water. You don't, you'll do that sometimes. When I you think get it might be soap or something. I don't know. That'd be even weirder. I I, I, oh! I, I pondered this during n my regular playthrough. This guy is Look literally dying. clam. This guy is literally dying. Hello? Is there anybody here? It's Freddy Fish and Luther. Hey, Daddy O, I'm Nick. I'm back here trying to fix this sign. Daddy O? Is he talking to us? Sure I am. It's all cool. Except that the bolt I need to hold this sign up fell into a clam's mouth. And now I'm trapped here. Maybe we can get the bolt out of the clam's mouth and Luther looks like he pulled an all-nighter. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Hey, Freddy, that reminds me of a knock-knock joke. Oh, knock, no. Knock-knock. Who's there? Dwayne. Dwayne who? Dwayne, Dwayne the tub, I'm drowning! <laughs> Did you see that? You made the clam laugh, Luther. He's like, no, you didn't. <laughs> Pretty, oh. Maybe we can get the bolt back while the clam opens up to laugh. Whatever you can do to help me out of this heinous situation would be appreciated. We're happy to help. Oh, that's from it's the... It's for the sign. It's for the sign. That's one tiny noose. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was like. <laughs> you hanging a goldfish? No, Freddy's a goldfish. Is Freddy a goldfish? I don't know. Freddy is a fish. 
Now I'm gonna Making go to the clam Google. laugh really hard is our only hope of getting that bolt out of its mouth. The clam <gasps> didn't laugh very hard at your knock knock joke, Luther. Can't you think of another kind of joke? My mind's a blank. I can't think of anything. We need to tell the clam another kind of joke. <laughs> Let's just get raw over here. Hey, so. Have you heard about the hot potato? No, never mind. Just drop it. <laughs> I told that pun in the You sure the would first like to see your act. store. I would really like to show it to you. We'd like to go into your store. No in. This sign is crushing my neck <laughs> right now. <laughs> Can we see your store? <laughs> All right, not much we can do here yet. Sorry, Nick, you're gonna have to just asphyxiate. Excuse me, I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my friend Luther. Hi. Well, hello. It's the... My name's Kit Craftsman. Hey, dude. It's the it's the guy that the lady was laying on his legs. Yep. It's him. He and um, claw machine repair lady are probably going out. I was mm. just deeply admiring my latest chip model. Wow. It must take a lot of patience to build these models all day. Each one is like a child to me. It hurts to let them go. You sure is have Is this a your lot business, building and selling them? No, I don't have a job. I just <laughs> build model ships all day. What do you use these for? The pliers? I'll use those to take this big ship apart. I can't find a model big enough to fit the thing. Taking a ship apart must be hard for you. Yeah. It's a heartbreaker. I wouldn't need the pliers if I had a big enough bottle for this ship. Maybe Why don't we you just keep the fish, the, keep the That'd ship intact fantastic. and not put it in a bottle? That's ridiculous. I need pliers for that. Pliers what? Pliers. Okay. All right. Well, oh wait, we should buy the planktonos. Unless we really want to save up for a joke. Well, don't we need a joke in order to get the thing out? Yeah, but we I think we can get it. We can probably get some purple sea urchins elsewhere. Nope, use soft lock. I'd like one bag of Plato's, please. Not a problem. One purple sea urchin. There you go. How did that not hurt? Purple sea urchins are very spiky. Is this so? <laughs> Thank. What? Is Sissel the what? ghost trick? Because he doesn't feel anything. Oh, oh. <laughs> That's all I'm thinking. I was very confused for a second there. Okay. I don't know where Our... the spot is that I used to lock it's all It's probably time. in Coral Cove Park. Yeah. Oh, boy. Now we need a new key to open it. Hmm. We needed square Which last time. What key could it be? Let's try C key. is for cookie. It's a moon. It is a moon. It's lovely tonight. All right, That's Mr. It. Barber Shop Man. Whoopee! <laughs> Whoopee! There, the keys. Gotta love the barber shop so chair. Goes right there Underwater. To find them. <laughs> and he I numbered all of his combs. Already. I can only comb the mayor's hair with my number seven comb. Do you remember what number he said? It was eight, I think. It was not. It, it was, was fifteen. Number fifteen. Anything. Okay. I just, I know you have to remember that, so I paid attention. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm not playing. This must right. be the fin pick Clyde needs Why to give the mayor his makeover. His we'll soon find out. The mayor refuses to leave his office. Is that so? That way he We don't actually... have a lock on the mayor's office. <laughs> you could just barge in and become the mayor. <laughs> this, the, the mayor apparently is not doing anything important. He's literally just like, I need my makeover. I need my makeover ASAP. Hey, Gillian. Gillian's like, Town Hall! This is the perfect place to sell planktonos! There you go. This should be the right fin pick, Clyde. Should be. Fin pick? Ooh, yes. You are so don't have efficient. Hair. Are you ready for the biggest ripoff of a makeover the ever? Makeover? Mm. But of course. I'll only be a moment. Then he throws the fin pick away. Then he cuts nothing. And then it's done, even though he looks exactly All the same. Done. See you tomorrow, Mayor Marlin. Splendid, splendid. 
And now he just admires his own reflection. <laughs> Guess not. <laughs> Very, yeah. You look so handsome, Mayor Marlin. You're a smart girl. You see, <laughs> looking good is part of my job as a public figure. All eyes are on me. Yeah, so do some work. You're being weird. Here, sign this. Don't look at it, just sign Mayor it. Mayor Marlin, we have a permission slip we'd like you to sign. It will allow us into Coral Cove Park so we can solve the mystery of this terrifying sea monster. Ugh. Luther's got some terrifying faces. Yeah. Huh? Oh, right. There is a sea monster terrorizing the citizens of Coral Oh, yeah. Coral well, it's not as important as what's in my reflection. <laughs> you don't have to read it. As a politician, he should. <gasps> He's gonna do it with his nose. Oh, I thought he was just gonna go... <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Mayor Marlin. Now, Officer Beverly... Thanks, will let Mayor Marlin. Freddy looks very park. mad. Yeah. She's like, did you have to rumple it and poke holes in it? Good luck to you both. The citizens of Coral Cove are lucky to have you here in times like these. Whoa! What kind of a society is this where literal children are being entrusted to drive away the, the sea, sea monster? monster. <laughs> well, these are the same children who stopped a slave ship, as you said. So. Well, the, hey, that was just because Cousin Calico was like, hey, you two should do <laughs> Cousin well, Calico's not very- I gotta stay here in case the hawkfish rustlers come back. Yeah, exactly. All right, now we can go to if Coral Cove. If they ran off with your- they're not gonna let you back. There right, you go. Here's the permission slip signed by Mayor Marlin himself. She's like, aha. Uh -huh. You don't say. Well, I'll be. Go on in, but remember what I said. That sea monster is huge. And it's evil. That's profiling. <laughs> no fear, eh, Freddy? No fear, Luther. Maybe the sea monster's a really swell guy. Yeah. Another purple sea urchin. We're getting rich. Did you ever get to the part where you actually see the sea monster? No. Oh, wow. Ooh, what's this? So. What's this? Yuck. It smells horrible. It's a, it's a, it's a dead fish. Look at the size of the bite. It's the size of the <laughs> Luffer just has a tape measure on him. It's his emergency tape measure. That bite's big enough to be a sea monster. That's just what I was thinking, Luther. But was it, Freddy? It's a pile of crap. The sea must have been eating it's like a giant green rock. <laughs> yeah. What? We're hot on the monster trail now. Freddy's just wandering around with a giant, like, piece of crap on her head the same size as her. Like, hi, everybody! I'm here to drop Solve off the your mystery call. of the sea monster. It's like, um, Freddy, Freddy why, why does that smell so bad? Don't ask. Don't worry about it. Which direction should we go? I want to go in the, the, the cave thing. Those meddlesome kids are gonna ruin my grand plan. Uh... Okay. Is this the place? No. I don't think so. <sighs> Ooh. That <laughs> That's how you open locked. doors. It was like a red cave. A um, red cave? What? Like part? it was like red and purple. I don't know. Maybe are you, it wasn't. Are you thinking of Freddy Fish 5? You're kind I of describing so. the carnival from Freddy Fish Free. Here's a way if I don't see it, then the I the game just must have locked. crashed earlier. Hmm. Oof. From what I was thinking. Are you sure? Figuring out how to get in here yes. took me a while, we even on my last way way in. Really? What? There was a chi uh, yeah. child fish. Oh yeah, so there are two different arrows. There's go up and then there's go right. You have to hit go right. 
And then for some reason, then it'll be Moofer, you go in. Oof. 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 I'm too big to fit through this hole. Let me try. Let me try. <laughs> there we go. Like a dream. Luther, you need to unlock the door so I can get in too. You got it, Freddy. I miss the pipes from Freddy Fish Free. Luther's inside the giant plane. Yeah. Got yellow on the right, blue and red on the left. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, I wonder what we're supposed to do. Maybe moving those colors around will unlock the door in the room above. Then I can let Freddy in. Yeah. There, there's a tough puzzle at the end. Is there? Yeah. I'm, I'm excited. Like, I actually had to... I struggled a little bit, even, <laughs> on my last playthrough. <laughs> Ages 3 to 8. Or if you're Artie, then you, uh, you're you going to struggle anyways. I, Artie, I struggle with every game. Even Pokemon. Do, 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 do. Pokemon's not a puzzle game. Okay, but Pokemon will be like, this is where you need to go. He tells you where to go, and I'll be like, where, do I, where am I supposed to go? You gotta sneak into the military compound and then battle Pokemon with the Secret Service agents. <laughs> Who knows? I don't know if that's a thing. Victory! You did it, Luther! Oh, boy. Oh, boy! Is that the compass that the lady needs? March the Tharge? We need a code to unlock this. Any ideas? Not yet. We may need some help with this one. I'll transmit the letter code to Marge in Morse code. Then she can use her decoder to break the code and send us back the letter combination to open the safe lock. URP and then we... Yeah, so we need to type URP to Marge in Morse code. Wow. So the U is dot dot dash dash. This was tough as a kid, trying to yeah. understand the Morse code, but it's cool. Dot, dash, dot. And then P is... That was the correct code, Luther! Now, all we have to do is decode the Morse code Marge sent and enter the <laughs> She sent it very fast! Wow! Look really fast. She was ready for that thing. one. I like her uh, though. Okay, okay, so dot, it's... dash, dot is R. R. We need to set... Just says rap. <laughs> rap definitely is the right one. Um, e. e. I guess it was B. <laughs> you were right. We did it! We yeah, yeah did I remember that being a tough puzzle. Luther. If you don't understand you don't the understand basics of Morse code. code here, is... March, it's me, Freddy. I can hear you loud and clear. What's up? We got into the safe on the Raymond Fitzpatrick, and I can see the Precision Mission Finder compass. <laughs> Good work. Get the compass. This is like a GTA heist. Over and out. <laughs> Go into back. the submarine. Send Lester <laughs> the Morse code. Oh, well, we don't need it anymore. Get back before the police find you. Well, <laughs> Booze the cops. The and meet Marge you back at the stars. base. <laughs> oh, that's it. <laughs> Well, they're children. They would only ever get three <laughs> They have three stars for stealing the compass in the bottom of the sunken ship. That nobody else is in. Except for that one fish who swam out through the hole to indicate, Hey, Luffy's small enough to swim through. No, nah, that fish definitely is up to no good. <laughs> he stole all the money that was in there and just <laughs> left the compass. <laughs> and by money, of course, I mean purple sea urchins. Purple sea urchins. 